Hi. Oh, hi. It's Paul. It's him. Doing a thing? Yeah, we are. My thing. Because cause I searched for my thing before I searched for anything you said. I'm worried. We're starting with my thing. I'm worried. Why? Because you told me one of the videos. From this album this is album very is scary for you. Oh, yes. Oh, Your Uncanny Valley response will be triggered very hard. This is not that one. That we know of. No, no, no. Maybe. He's referencing Rata Mahata, which is the same director as the Green Jelly, Three Little Pigs. Same exact director of the Claymation, Three Little Pigs. Which, which is Nightmare night Fuel. For you is Nightmare Fuel. Yeah. Yes. But Rambo shows up in that. I don't care. Gotta call Rambo. No, Claymation Rambo shows up. If Rambo showed up, <laughs> I'd be fine. Claymation Rambo was kind of terrifying. But this is the uh, same album, but this is Roots Bloody Roots. By okay. Sepultura. I saw them with this album. It was the last one with Max, the lead singer, before he left to create Soulfly. Okay. And like, uh, for, like when he left us, I was just like, oh, man, another one. Yeah, no, he's still with us. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, Max does a lot of stuff. Oh, okay. But um, he's still around. So, uh, Sepultura, you ready? Yeah. Do you, you, know, you, know, you don't know anything. No, you so know nothing. It's Brazilian metal. Okay. It's got that Brazilian flavor. Okay. Which I really only know what that is because Sepultura. So, like, capoeira kind of stuff? Sure. Big booties? Sure. I don't know what Brazilian flair. Lots of green? The other video has uh, the Gracie family in it. We could do that one next. Uh, Attitude. Okay. That one has the Gracies in it. That's very Brazilian. Doing the jiu-jitsu, yes, that they're, they're known for. You ready? Okay. Let's do it. Let's see if you like it. Yeah, it should. Well, that's a scary start. Capoeira! I was right! I know you were. <laughs> I know you were. I was like, boom, no sell it. No sell it. <laughs> no sell the shit out of it. <laughs> I know sold the shit out of that. <laughs> you did. It's a real mask. Don't get don't don't get scared. Mm-hmm. <laughs> looks like Chris Pines. Yeah. You think so? I do like the drum line in the back. I, I mean, coordinated dancing, I always get happier. Yeah. Yeah, they do a lot of really cool drumming stuff. I mean, the drummer's really good. It's actually his brother, Igor. Igor? Igor. But, um, yeah, this is the last, like, album of him on Sepultura. They had a falling out, a disagreement. Uh, okay. Um, about many things, including money, and he was just like, screw it. And he formed Soulfly, and he's been with Soulfly ever since. Okay. I think they're a little cooler than they used to be. Everybody's kind of, you know, nice with each other. Mm-hmm. Um, but Sepultura has a different singer, and that guy's pretty good, too. Okay. This isn't bad. Yeah. I knew you would like the drum work in a lot of yes. these. but Definitely um, like the drum work. Guitar work's really good, too. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, they're kind of known for just, like, heavy, but, like... They're like a somewhere bridging between like what new metal became and the thrash scene, mm-hmm. uh, and they're a lot of people really like their '80s stuff. Okay, prior to this or early, it might be like late '80s, early. Okay, 90s. so they've been around a long. They've time. They've been around a while. Okay, mm-hmm. and they just have many incarnations and many different moments. Okay, especially with the singer change as well. Yeah, it's not bad. I'm it's, glad it's you're doing it. It's definitely not bad. I mean, I definitely like. I think that the the scenery and all that kind of stuff is kind of like helping. Uh, the video out. I don't know if this is like a song that I would be like definitely for, but like I, there's nothing in here that like I'm like against. Right. Maybe the guy with the painted on mask a little bit, <laughs> just, a, just a titch, just a. That's fine. Just a titch, but like other than that, there's nothing in this video that's like irritating. I would, I would me. love for you to hear Rada Mahata. I 
I don't. I, I, I'll have to find a live video. Maybe. Maybe, but, there's, maybe there's a good live one. Yes. No claymation. It's, no. It's a shame. It's such. It's really. It is a scary video. I've only for put you. one video on here that like I, know. I watched. And, I like know. it was Sia. I know. It. It was just. This is way more fuel. terrifying oh, than that. Fuck that. I no. promise you, it is. I it's believe. It's designed you. to be I, scary. Oh, I think no. it's actually. A, if I remember correctly, it's about different spirits in Brazilian folklore. It's no. legit scary. It would make you poop your pants. No. Okay. Well, this one's good. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, this is fine. <laughs> Hello, Sarah. Hi, Sarah. I think those are actual catacombs. Mm-hmm. In Brazil. Yeah, he's giving me a little not nice. But and he's getting worse. That shredding really has, like, like that was a very popular, like, distortion sound back then. Yeah. I don't know if this is drop D, but it's a lower tone. Because I've definitely heard, like, that sound. Well, like, what he was playing was very thrash. Mm. But this is very more new metal. Mm. happy I got the Kepler. I can't believe I was able to know so. <laughs> I was like, mm, yep. <laughs> it's like, I'm pretty sure this video just starts with it. <laughs> okay, that wasn't bad. Yeah. It wasn't bad at all. Yeah. I was worried. I was very worried. Yeah, I mean, I there's Sepultura you might like better, you might like worse. I, we would have to play around to figure that out. Mm -hmm. But um, just as far as, like, this album did immensely well for them, and then the split just kind of, like, made everybody sad. Mm -hmm. um, Soulfly was out by 2000, 2001. I want to say this album was, like, 96. Maybe I got that? No, Soulfly was earlier than that. Okay. So this was, oh, like... Oh, so this was really early. 96 is when he split. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah. And then uh, they got... Oh, so high school, Okay. I was expecting this. When you say new metal, I was I'm thinking like I meant the two, genre. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like I was thinking like 2000s, 2000 like up to like 2010. You were just like, I mean, like, and, holy. and Soulfly it goes a little bit all over. Sometimes they're heavier, sometimes they're more Okay. Meh. But like when they're on, they're on mm -hmm. and uh, it would sound fairly similar to this. So okay. if you enjoy that, there's a ton between Sepultura and Soulfly we can check out. Okay, we can definitely check that out. And then. I'll definitely refresh myself on the videos to make sure there's nothing scary. Thank you. Them. Appreciate I, it. I will never it's... forget Rada Mahara. It's very spooky. Very spooky. Very cool. Everybody go check that out, though. You yeah, know, the little pig, little pig thing was just, no. That's... <laughs> that guy's so good. I think he also did a tool video, if I remember correctly. Probably. I think he did Sober. <laughs> that, sounds, that sounds right up the album. Sober or Prison Sex or sounds, one of them. Sounds right up the album. Just one of those Nightmare ones. Fuel yeah, all the way through. The guy was good at it. You know. <laughs> well, you're down for some more Sepultura yes, and potentially is... some Soulfly. Yeah, absolutely. This, There's a lot of cool is... Brazilian metal, uh, but they're like the, get, the biggest ones. Mm -hmm. uh, there was a band called like Overdose I really liked. That came out of this time. I think they actually have a split with Sepultura. I would love to find some stuff by them. Mm. They were very good. I think there's like seven bands with the name Overdose. So, but the one that sounds kind of like this, that's the one. Mm. It's just interesting. Like '96. So, like I'm thinking back. It's, that's like that's record stores and all that kind of stuff. That like, I yeah, that, I saw them with. They opened for Ozzy when okay. I saw them, and Danzig opened. It was okay. weird. It was yeah, yeah. Was Sepultura then Ozzy. Yeah, Ozzy, I was very. I was Ozzy. firmly. 96, I was firmly Spice pop, Girls. pop princess. Spice Girls? Era. Spice Girls? 96? No, no, that was 98. Oh. 97, 98. Who was, the, um, who was the pop standout in 96? Well, this would be like, well, there was like a little bit of, uh, there was a lot of sports that was 95. 
Okay, so, so she would have been going strong here. Yeah, she was going really strong. That's fair. Still. She's less um, poppy, though. No. What would be trying to poppy think. Poppy in 96. Jennifer Lopez? No, that was later. J-Lo was later, right? Jennifer Love Hewitt. <laughs> Jennifer Love Hewitt, yeah. That was, yeah, that was, no. You know what, 95, 96? 95, 96 was heavy big band sky era. Sure, so that is like I'm talking pop. That's still pop. Like that's very much like top forty now. At the time, it is. It is that top, was top forty. It is top forty, but I wouldn't call it. Yeah, but I that can't kind remember of, who was pop. Let me know in the comments below. I'm, yeah, I'm who was pop in '96? Because like right now, all I'm thinking of is like real big fish. And, well, it's funny because and jiving whale. Right, but sure, but rock and I and, know they're not the same band. I'm just sure. Please, but God, rock don't come at me for that. Rock was more on the mainstream charts then. Yeah, whereas like they don't exist now. No. So um, yeah. It was a very different world. Yeah. I'm aware Brian sets a orchestra like that were just like, Real Big Fish didn't do that. I was like, I'm aware. I like the crossover between the Sepultura fans and the Brian Setzer <laughs> Orchestra. I like that. That's fun. I would love to chart out the Venn diagrams that we oh, think be... exist. Well, I know what mine is, so I know what is possible. I go so all over the place. Yeah. Like my Venn and diagram. You are people, starting to for sure. My Venn diagram people would be like, Why? Why is a good question. Because like a lot of what I listen to just doesn't mesh. Especially now. Now with this. Now people are just yeah. like, it's just a bunch of circles <laughs> just that are just far, far away from each other. That's fair. It's like Sepultura, Taylor Swift. That, that's not There's a... the mashup we need. <laughs> Someone. Is, is there one out there? There probably is. Yeah. I mean, there's an I Prevail Taylor Swift cover. Okay. That's there. I actually like. Not bad. No. Blank spaces. Good time. Anyway, Don't like, subscribe, all that kind of fun stuff. Catch them out on Campus of Scouts. Catch me out on Campfire Ashes, their podcast. No. Uh, you can check them out on Spotify, Amazon, uh, Apple Music, wherever you find your podcasts. No. Uh, I'm also on Twitch, uh, Team Ashen. Uh, links to the original video as well as our merch links and our Patreon will be in the description down below. Yeah. And we'll catch you next time. We'll be there.